What's going on, everybody? Thanks for joining us today. We're PGH Reactions, a group of friends in Pittsburgh watching TV and movies over a couple of beers and discussing it afterwards. I'm Rob. My name's Josh. I'm Jake. I'm Brian. I'm Warren. It's good to be back, guys. We took a two-week break, clear our heads a little bit, but we're back. We got a lot of stuff to film for you. We're really looking forward to it. And today we are watching episode six of What If uh, Killmonger Rescued Tony Stark. I see. I just yeah. looked at the title right there. Um, oh, right. Yeah, um, last time we watched zombies, it looks fucking awesome. Yeah. Everybody died. That was, <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> <It> was <great. laughs> so I'm really wondering where they're going to go with this. Um, Cap still in the tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> um, in the context of just looking at this title, I know that from what I remember with Black Panther, Killmonger was in the Marines, was mm -hmm. he? I believe um, so. So it would kind of overseas. make sense to me going this route. I mean,. It, it, it's a good what if. Yeah, it's a good, I mean, it's a good I what if. See it. I don't really have any expectations for it. I've, I mean, I've been really excited for this episode because I think it's going to be one of the most ambitious ones we've seen yet. Okay. Because the what if moment goes from movie one, phase one, mm -hmm. the very start of everything, True. till Black Panther, damn near the end of phase three. No. They're just point, going yeah. all the way back. All the other ones were like in the middle somewhere and just changed one thing that affected everything else. Mm -hmm. This is the start and the end coming together. So I yeah, think this is gonna yeah. be a really good episode. I mean, yeah, I guess you're right that everything we've seen is just changing something in the moment, and mm -hmm. this is combining two things at two opposite ends of the <laughs> MCU. Yeah. yeah. I didn't even think about that. That's, think a, about that's a good point. Yeah. I'm ex I've, I got, I'm so stoked I, for this I, episode. I got a good feeling about today. I gotta tell you guys a very short story about somebody coming into my job today in an Audi R8. That's the car that Tony Stark drives. Okay. And he pulled up and he had an Iron Man front license plate. And I stopped him and I knocked on his window and he rolled it down and I said, are you Tony Stank? And his girlfriend <laughs> lost his shit. <laughs> I was like, all right, come on. <laughs> that's funny yeah. as well. <laughs> Thought you guys would like that. Yeah, that's great. Dang. Any other thoughts before we watch this, boys? No. Do you no. think that uh, Tony will not go to protecting and he'll just continue to make weapons because he hasn't? I think been... he'll make weapons for Killmonger. That's a good point. I don't know. But call, I think it depends was... on if he sees his own name on that rocket because that I think that, that was the that key was thing. The that thing. thing. That was in Iron Man. That was the key thing for him. Is that yeah. he's killing, getting killed by like, his. Like, oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> well, him not getting it. captured by um, the Ten Rings. Because it was the ten rings. It was the ten yeah, rings. So then nothing bad would happen to his heart. Exactly. That's also he, true. He won't need to make that. Like it, it's gonna change fucking everything. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's. let's yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, you brought up a lot of good points. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, but I really thought of nothing. Yeah. Let's watch. It's, it's funny because they're, they're, they're trying to be good. They're yeah, trying to. Yeah. They're trying to like. Uh, uh, train us to be ready for these what if moments mm -hmm. in, of the multiverse. yeah because of the multiverse and jake's like info <laughs> dump <laughs> all right good job jake yeah, good multiverse job well, i'm super excited i think we should just okay. get started but oh, yeah. before we do you know the drill the channel's not a market substitute make sure you go on your own disney plus account watch this yourself and come back here and watch it with us it's that easy come on man do it yourself <laughs> you boys ready? Yeah. All right. Let's, let's go. This. Tony Stank. At full screen subtitles. Oh, oh no! no! <laughs> oh, <damn it>! no! <laughs> <laughs> it's <stuck>! <laughs> <laughs> We're out of practice. Yes. <laughs> it's been a few weeks. <laughs> Space. It's not to be a watcher. What do you do? Do the question. And be an omnipotent being. You watch! <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. God, that I sounds... Well, you. actually, that's like so... That's, that's <laughs> what we're doing. It's <laughs> your responsibility, dude. You just watch. Yeah, peace. I love peace. I'd be out of a job in peace. You didn't set my space page. Seen it. Ha! <laughs> Damn, dude. The ten rings have reinforcements in route. We need to move now. Oh! Okay. Kill monster? What is that, German? A nickname. Damn, dude. Did you learn any lessons?
asked from your time in Afghanistan. I did. Never travel anywhere that doesn't have a Four Seasons. <laughs> Such an asshole. Well, I love it. Which is why I'm bringing in Lieutenant Eric Stevens, the Navy SEAL who saved my life, as Stark Industries' new Chief Security Officer. This is such a lot of bull. It's supposed to be my promotion. Wow. Proud about this conversation. Yeah, yeah, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Because those plans were being played by Stark Industries. Michael P. Jordan. <laughs> Dude, one peaked at MTV, one peaked at MCU. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Different acronyms. <laughs> yes! Oh man, repulsive tactics. Wow. I'm gonna drive the Jericho into a portable firearm. That cheap pop. That easy killer. Come in peace. Come in peace. Yeah, it's... That's right. Peace means having a bigger stick than the other guy. What about you? You close with yours? Nah. He died too. Gang violence. Weapons in the wrong hands. Kind of. No one had to fire them at all. I killed by the king of Wakanda, but, you know. And again. Let's do this. Let's build your science care project. You saved my life. I'm like, okay. And then he, he's going to use that tech, take over Wakanda, then take over the world. Yep. Bold design choice. What? I like Adam. I was thinking Gundam's going to make a Gundam joke. He just said He just said Gundam model. Just going to make a joke. Put it down, soldier. Hey, if you could miniaturize an arc reactor. You just got to have the right hook. I might have just the guy. Ulysses Flaw? Uh, oh my god! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm feeling this. I like mean, yeah, it's like Age of Ultron. Yeah, yeah. 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 yep. That's what it feels like. I've got the likes on me. What's going on here? Stolen. Find them and lock them up. Lock them up. Killmonger's gonna steal it. Unlock this. Nah, no, he's there. gonna steal it. Killmonger! It couldn't be Ultron. It's how many great Ultron. Killmonger's gonna steal this shit. No, it's just one guy. Oh, it is. Yep, it is Black Panther. I think he did. I, because, I think he did. I think that's the exact same Killmonger, but we just met him sooner. Because gotcha. yeah. all his storylines were the same, as far as I remember. Tony about that shit. Wish it didn't have to go down like this. Tony had to what? Kid, you gotta be part of the system to change the system. Nah, you can burn it down. Oh, what the Killed Rhodey? Adora will be here soon. Oh my god. I don't like this. This is ridiculous. He is savage. Always was, man. Yeah. But not to everything. Oh shit, he saw it all! Guys, never play Clue with Jarvis. I melted down that ring of yours. He made the- Oh! <laughs> you were right, vibranium worked like a charm. Dude, he could have easily just turned to Tony. Yeah. 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 how Tony wants it. No, because he has that vibranium. I've seen the Mandalorian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, you know what happens. He killed him by stabbing him in his shoulder. That, that doesn't that happen. Feel like that. He could have easily just passed out from. There's game. nothing vital up here. The Patriot Act should cover the red tape. The U.S. military is hereby seizing control of all Stark Industries. Oh, Jesus. fuck. Nope. You just invented 21st century fuck. warfare. Vegeta over here. Yeah, yeah, he really does look like Vegeta. <laughs> he likes anime. <laughs> Sad daddy. Like you said, Wakanda's a full of surprises. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> God. I come with a gift. An awesome Brian and Jadaka, son of the Prince and Jobo. I know what it's like to have someone taken from me. And if I had the chance to avenge my father, I wouldn't hesitate. He watched him These kill his dad, so he knows. Even if there's only a chance, I. It's like the 
opposite that of that Game, Game of Thrones. Thrones. Yeah. <laughs> I was just thinking that! <laughs> Entrusting our pet to this outsider. He is feminine. Open the shields. She's so tiny. Yeah, she's so tiny. This is was years before my manager. Yeah. He dropped a fucking up click in there or something. Yeah. He turned on his hot spot. <laughs> We've never seen their shield line charge like that. That's cool. Fucking <laughs> 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 amazing. <laughs> Cry yeah. Forever! Fucking asshole. They're probably fucking programmed not to attack him. <laughs> yeah. Wakanda! Forever! I don't like how he says that. Forever! Yeah! Help Jeff Chawa's here. I'm like, you bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, man! <laughs> I know what you did. Was it worth it? You bitch. Bitch. <laughs> you bitch. I did what I had to do. Oh, 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 oh. Destroyers are circling the African coast. Wow. All Jericho missiles locked and loaded by 0600. Yes, sir. I'll do respect, sir. <laughs> what? Hello. How so. did you get in here? <laughs> I'm here to help this puzzle. <clears throat> My cousin is an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I would. He killed Tony. So, let us open their eyes to get him. Heroes are never really gone. Yep. Nice. They live forever. As do the ones they inspire to carry on the fight. That's it? Yeah. Wow. That I feel like was a very open-ended ending. I, I feel like we're getting a follow-up. Yeah. No, I felt like that was pretty good. I felt concise. like that was no. pretty good. I like that ending. I like it being open like that. Yeah. Because it's a, a standalone I, story. I felt like that was in no way open, dude. Like, it that was, was open-ended. That was open-ended. That, that... <laughs> it echoes a lot of what Marvel has set up, you know, with, like, the legacy being brought on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, with uh, Iron Man and uh, Cap and everything. I still get fucking chills every time I hear Chadwick Boseman's voice. It's... I still I I got chills seeing him in that man. So 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 figure out how to not blink. Pretty dark. I didn't blink. <laughs> I uh, pretty bleak. Uh, uh, yeah, dude, I fucking loved it. I thought that was you, the best episode yet. Oh, wow. You were it, right about the spanning the multiple stuff because they even covered additional movies mm -hmm. in there too. Yeah, I, they, <laughs> yeah that, that span of very fast like period that felt like uh infinity war because at the end <laughs> uh the bad guy wins and then it kind of just fades away and everybody's sitting there like what <laughs> the fuck just happened <laughs> <laughs> See, you guys were saying that you felt that that was left open-ended i felt the exact opposite i felt like the bad guy won completely but he but he wasn't always, going to win he, in the end he won't always win that no, shot with was... him, with the the three Black Panthers in the tree, T'Challa told him, essentially, you may have won in life, but you're gonna die and come here sometime. Yeah. Yeah, but we, and, like... And but... then Pepper and Shuri at the end are saying the two smartest people in the room are gonna take him down. Yeah. He's gonna be brought down eventually, and even if they don't get him, he's gonna get God in the afterlife. Right, like, we, we, get, we get that, but we don't know how it's gonna happen. That doesn't matter. Like... But it's gonna it's, happen. But that's gonna the point end. of it. Like, that's the point of it being open ended. Is like we. That's well, one of the hopeful. what if there, questions. There's no solution. That, like, it's we, just hope. Right. There's there's hope and there's just we don't know how exactly it's gonna happen. And we're probably never going to see how it's gonna happen. I don't want to say hundred percent. I would. I, I would be displeased if we ever did. I I kind of disagree that we won't. Because I, because again, I think all these are going to tie in. Again, each other. keep in mind that what if was supposed to be one very long season, and they sure. broke it up into two. I think that we're establishing all these stories, and that some of them are going to get follow-ups in season two. Oh, that'd especially be cool. Especially if, especially if the if rumors that they're going to come together somehow. I, I just, I think we're going to get follow-ups. That'd be After cool. That episode, I would, I'd agree with you mm -hmm. because that one will. That has a lead up to a follow up. 
I feel like the Doctor Strange episode could have a follow-up. The Zombies one could have a follow-up. No, this no, absolutely no, could. Follow up. The Doctor Strange one, where he collapses his own universe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was How in, can you follow that up? He collapsed the whole universe. <laughs> I, thought, I thought he collapsed on him. Like he could yeah, be, he collapsed on him. He could be powerful enough to go to another universe. I yeah, know. if he can yeah. see the Watcher, he might yeah. be able to jump around. <clears throat> he well, could the Watcher use, could pull him out of there. No. He could, he could no. use the time stone and froze everything. No. You know, as far as this episode, yeah. I think they could definitely do like a follow-up one to yeah. this to show like the other heroes that we haven't seen coming together to well, stop. Well, if you think about it, up till this point in the MCU, they covered almost fucking everything on Earth. But just on Earth. Guardians are still up there. Mm-hmm. Thor's still fucking around doing whatever he's mm-hmm. doing. And Thanos is still killing everybody. Yeah. What happens in this universe they created when Thanos comes to Earth? He's going to win instantly. See, well, There's no yeah. one to defend him. Like defend against them, but this, all of this, these stories are different universes. I'm just you know, talking about. They're different I'm, I'm talking lines. about the long, the length that this episode could reach because it started at the very beginning and retconned. Oh, I see what you mean. Like timeline wise, it didn't touch. It didn't affect anything in space. Off of Earth, it affected nothing. Thanos is still Space. out there and killing everything. Like, yeah. it, it's the worst scenario for any MCU mm-hmm. thing we've seen so far. The absolute worst scenario for Thanos to come for no one Hide to be kids. able there. Hide your wife. Yeah, I mean, because he's <laughs> killing half the motherfuckers too, out you know, here. Like, they're saying, you know, Tony Stark, the hero, never got to be in this universe, and that Tony Stark always had his mind set up there after the Avengers. Yep. Th- that, you know that was I mean? one and of the... that's You don't have anybody doing that right now. That stood out to me most was the poster around the world. of Tony Stark's death. What was it in the movies? Like, always remember? I know that's 9-11, but like, it was something along those lines of like... After he died? After, in um, Homecoming. Homecoming. Or no, far it was Far From Home. Yeah, yeah. excuse uh, me. Yeah, it, far from, was, far from it was home. all stuff that was just like, thank you, Tony. It, it was like, all thank you. thankful yeah. messages, empowering yeah. messages, never yeah. forget kind of messages. Yeah. yeah. In this, Memorials it, everywhere, basically. Yes. Yeah. Positivity, mm-hmm. essentially. That was a straight army recruiting propaganda yeah, yeah. message it was it's like Killmonger looked like did Uncle nothing Sam. but spread anger and war and yeah. that's just no matter where Killmonger. he goes there's war fighting <laughs> it became constantly. a terrorist basically, yeah, basically. Like you can't America. end yeah. fighting <coughs> with fighting <coughs> you end fighting with snacks <laughs> yeah so marshmallows <laughs> and uh, ginger ale <laughs> or some shawarma <laughs> <laughs> it's how it's how Timmy and South Park got the Crips and the Bloods to like hang out. Nice. Well, Marshmallows true, and yeah. ginger ale. <laughs> Marshmallows and ginger ale. I'm <laughs> at the <laughs> There's pizzas and pool. <laughs> it fixes everything, man. Yeah, and then why can't we do that? Just <laughs> eat along. Come on. <laughs> Come, come always, on, everybody! Just to come, I mean, come on! Come I think it. of Killmonger. I've always thought of Killmonger in the same vein that I think of Joffrey. Like I hate their characters, and I know that's because they're playing them correctly. I yeah, agree he does that. a good I job. I've he always hated guy. Killmonger, and I know that's because he's been doing a good job. And this just furthered my hate for him. That no matter mm-hmm. what universe you put in him, he's always a fucking asshole. Yeah. I, I never see. thought about that comparison. Well, you kill my dad them. when I'm yeah. a little kid. <laughs> see what the fuck happens. I'm gonna kill every motherfucker and scar myself up. <laughs> I mean, most people see therapists, but he <laughs> just <laughs> he just chose. He to took just a just different just... approach. Yeah. I mean. I mean. Yeah, yeah you're yeah. right. Yeah. He's just 13 reasons why. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. He, he had he had oh like 480 god. reasons yeah. why. <laughs> Yeah, and he marked them all on his body. Yeah. Did he add one for ten? <laughs> I think that's what he was doing. I oh. think that looked like what he was doing after he came. He's like, he didn't make the cut. Didn't make the cut. You know, I was always curious <laughs> watching Black Panther. Like, how specifically did he cut himself to make those marks? What did he use? How did he? Anything. Like, what, what, you gotta like, go this, a certain depth in order to make a scar. Picturing yeah. that like weirded me out, but then uh, 
I still Hot gotta think like how the fuck did he do that? People do that in real life. Like yeah, I know. And I, I'm not googling it. But uh, yeah, my <laughs> vibranium. Like, <that's> <laughs> hey, probably okay. heated up this ring or something. And like, that's a good point. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's just a gas. So. He took a pizza roll out of the oven. <laughs> 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 You're supposed to let him sit for two minutes. <laughs> no, kill my <Killmonger>, don't. <laughs> <laughs> I love Totino's pizza rolls. <laughs> wow. Thanks again for watching along with us today, everybody. Hope you had a good time. And if you did, please consider subscribing to the channel so you can see all of our future content. If you feel so inclined, click that little like button. It really helps the channel out a lot. And if there's something that you want us to watch in the future, something you want to yell us at, yell at us about, I don't know, something you want to complain about. Can't whatever, yell on the internet. Tell us down below. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, lady, bye. Yes. Yes. <laughs> bye. Fucking nerds. <laughs>